all biotech professionals and students. This video we would like to dedicate for all the women who have contributed in the past 10 years to life science industry. There were times when women had not been taking part in social activities other than religious and cultural works, not only in India but throughout the world. Gradually, the society progressed and men in the family started considering the potential of the women folk outside the home as well. Starting from Anandi Bai Gopal Rao Joshi, who was the first Indian woman doctor, to Kalpana Chawla, the first Indian woman to go to space. We have numerous examples in our own country where women proved their potential to equally lead the male-dominated science fraction. Let us have a look at some of the latest contributions made by women scientists in life science field in the last 10 years. The first name which comes in our mind is Françoise Barry Sinossi. She shared the Nobel Prize of 2008 in Physiology or Medicine with Luc Montagnier for their discovery of human immunodeficiency virus, HIV. Second leading woman is Elizabeth Blackburn. She was awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine 2009 along with Carol Grader and Jack Sostak for the discovery on telomere and telomeres. Third leading scientist is Carol W. Grader, who shared the 2009 Nobel Prize with Elizabeth Blackburn and Jack W. Zostak for discovering telomere functions and telomeres activity. She is the perfect example for kids with behavioral issues. Fourth reputed name is Ada E. Yonat. She was the awardee of the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for the year 2009 to regard his studies of translation of DNA information by ribosomes. The fifth name that comes in our mind now is May Britt Moser. She was the Nobel Laureate in Physiology. The sixth women who contributed to our society are Tu Yao Yao. She won the Nobel Prize for Physiology or Medicine for the succeeding year 2015. It was shared with William C. Campbell and Satoshi Omura. The seventh name is Frances Arnold. She is the fifth woman to receive the Chemistry Nobel. She is an American chemist. She had received half of the prize for being the first to artificially direct the evolution of enzymes. The eighth name is Barbara Rosemary Grant. She has shared Kyoto Prize 2009 with her husband Peter Raymond Grant for the year for their remarkable demonstration of rapid evolution caused by natural selection in response to environmental changes. The ninth respected name is Linda J. Seff. She became the first women scientist to win the Wolf Prize Agricultural Awardee in 2015 for her contributions in the field of virology and immunology. The last but not the least name is Xiao Wei Zhong, who is the recipient of one of the most prestigious awards, Heineken Prize 2018 in Biochemistry, along with several other honours. It's inspiring to see the contributions of these women scientists in life science field, yet many more milestones are yet to be achieved. To know in detail about these respected women, visit the link mentioned in the description below. We would like to know your views as well on how can women scientists contribute more to society? How can more women be encouraged to join the life science research field, especially in India? What are the steps that government as well as private institutes should take in this direction? Do share your views in the comment section below.